Hi! Um, it's the month of May. No. It's the month of... <laughs> wow. It's the month of... Wow, I should just start again. Hi! It's the month of March and we're celebrating Colorectal Cancer Awareness Month. Uh, this month. Wow. Hi everybody, it's March and we're celebrating Colorectal Cancer Awareness this month. So I was unwell and we're making conversation over dinner and uh, this is the joke that my dad decided to share with me. There was a barber who figured out that there was one problem in giving his male clients the most perfect shave ever was uh, some of these curves, you know, in people's jaws and cheeks kept him from, you know, giving the, giving them the smoothest shape. So he decided to to offer a wooden ball uh, to these men so that they could put that in their mouth and then essentially that would happen and then he could like give them the smoothest shave. He gave this ball to one of his next clients and then the client was like, oh, but like, what happens if I if I swallow it? And so he was like, ah. Don't worry, just do what everyone else does. Just wash it and bring it back next day. So that is the, the joke that my dad told me. And yes, of course, it is a poop joke. And today we're going to be talking about it. So when you're sick, you have a lot of things that you think about. And I thought about a lot of crap. And I figured that there's exactly three kinds of crap. The first one is one that comes out in installments. Yeah, you know, you know that stuff is just making its way out, it hasn't yet, it's not yet fully finished, but you know that you're paying easy installments for last night's Swiggy order. So that's the first kind of poop. The second kind of poop is pretty self-explanatory. It is. I did that. Well, not, not that kind of poop, but oh well, this is already over explaining. Oh god. <laughs> and the third kind of poop is the best kind, and you know what I'm talking about. That is one big long piece of dirt that is so satisfying. And it's this third piece of dirt that makes me sometimes wonder if well, something that size, um, that length, that good, felt so good on its way out. A colonoscopy does not have to be so bad now, does it? So, in celebrating uh, Colorectal Cancer Awareness Month, I'm going to talk about how it is very important for everyone over the age of 50 years to get a colonoscopy. A colonoscopy is a is a test um, that is done in which uh, you know a camera is passed through your rectum, and then uh, it can take pictures and images of the insides of your large intestine, and it looks for any changes that might be there. Sometimes it can pick up these abnormal growths called polyps, and sometimes it can even pick up you know early stages of colon cancer. We know that the earlier uh, that colorectal cancer is picked up, the greater the survival rates are. In fact, uh, colorectal cancer at, at later stages can have survival rates as low as 10%. But colorectal cancer if diagnosed at stage 1, survival rates are about as high as 90%. So, let's talk about poop and uh, let's not be afraid to get colonoscopies. Um, that's it. My name is Pooja Ramchandran. I'm the Director of Genetic Counseling at Math Magazine. We will be sharing some articles about what colorectal cancer is and what signs to look out for. But uh, today was just this video talking about poop. Bye.